Choose your fighter. Lightning Inspired. Fight. 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 a lot of protein in every meal is so important especially when you're in a caloric deficit hey guys welcome back to my channel it's your girl Selamar today we're going to be doing a what I eat in a day video I eat pretty much the same thing every day but I'll just show you guys that I'm in a caloric deficit right now so that means that I'm my body is burning more calories than I'm eating but I'm also gonna work out today so those calories that I burn when I work out I get to consume I don't restrict myself I don't demonize food I feel like I eat pretty bad I do an 80-20 rule, so that means I eat 80% healthy and then I eat 20% like what I want. But don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe so you can keep seeing more videos like this if you enjoy these. And let's just get right into the video. I have the same thing every day. We're gonna do eggs, turkey, ham, mozzarella cheese. I don't like to eat right when I wake up. I like to eat maybe an hour after I wake up. We're gonna do about this much ham. And we're also gonna get some onion powder. And then we just mix it. Basically all protein and fat. Having a lot of protein in every meal is so important, especially when you're in a caloric deficit. You're really eating like less calories, so your body might feel more sluggish than it usually does. It's really important to eat protein in every meal. Oh yes, daddy! So I just finished filming a workout video. I did a HIIT workout, so I burned maybe around like two to 300 calories. my snack before I have lunch. So I usually have the Greek yogurt from Fage or Fage or whatever it's called, but they ran out, I guess. So I'm gonna have this. It's really high in protein. 15 grams of protein, no added sugar, and the macros look pretty good. 100 calories, only 10 grams of fat, and then it has five sugar. We're gonna do that with a tablespoon of peanut butter for a snack. We're gonna have lunch slash dinner. We're gonna make chicken breast tenderloinies or whatever they're called. We're gonna do like a stir fry of vegetables like asparagus, a tomato, yellow pepper, and onion. We're also gonna do spinach ricotta tortelloni. Gonna show you the whole process. All right, so this is what it ends up looking like. This is the size of my hand. Um, this is about maybe like one and a half of the chicken breast tenderloinies. Then I have asparagus and all the other stuff you guys saw. And then here is the thing. I just put a little bit of olive oil on it. And now I'm gonna fuck it up. I just woke up from a nap, as you can tell. We don't know what's going on here. We ate around like seven or eight o'clock. And right now it's 11. So it's pretty late. So we're gonna have one more meal for the day. I had another one of those yogurts. I didn't put the clip in. I literally just ate it right after I ate that meal and then I knocked out. And now I'm gonna make a protein shake just so I make sure that I get enough protein in for the day and that my body is filled up, okay? Before I actually go to sleep, I'm just gonna have this protein shake and I'm just gonna show you guys how to make it because I know I get a lot of questions on how I make my protein shake. I'll just show you that. I usually have muscle milk, but I brought my own protein powder to my boyfriend's place, so I'll just use that. All right, so these are the ingredients that I use. I just have the regular almond milk, 80 calories, 
I'm gonna put so much cinnamon in there. I got the Quaker oats. Putting oats in your um, smoothie is a really good way to like fill up. And then I'm gonna put maybe one to two tablespoons of peanut butter. And then this is the protein powder that I use. It's just a regular protein powder, uh, 25 grams of protein. So my camera was not recording, but I put in about this much milk cinnamon. And then I put maybe like three to four tablespoons of oats. We're just gonna do one big scoop like this. And then I'm just gonna eat this. And then we're gonna pour all of this in. And this is obviously vanilla flavored. Oh my god, I'm struggling. So that's what it looks like. Beautiful, beautiful. There you have it. I'm about to drink this and then I'm gonna brush my teeth and go to sleep but usually I put fruit in my protein smoothies but like I said I'm at my boyfriend so there's like a lack of ingredients <laughs> um but yeah I usually put like banana and strawberry to make it taste good this is like 25 grams of protein maybe even more because I put peanut butter and oatmeal in it and almond milk has protein in it also um, I'm just gonna drink this This is so fire, guys. Especially with oatmeal. And the cinnamon. Ooh. I'm gonna close out the vlog here. It's pretty much the end of the day. I'm gonna go to sleep. Thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe to see more videos like this. And let me know any more video suggestions that you guys wanna see. I read all my comments, so if you recommend something, I'll most likely do it.